Hi, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Diagrams tutorial series, you will learn how to create a simple pros and cons diagram in PowerPoint. The diagram you will learn to create is this, where there is a beautiful and simple visual cue which shows the pros and the cons for the argument. Let us see how to create this diagram from scratch by going to a new slide. First, I am going to create the visual cue using arrows. So let us go to Auto Shapes menu under block arrows, pick this one called as the right arrow and draw the right arrow here. And we are going to call this pros. Let us increase the size to say 28. And anything positive, we are going to give green color and for anything negative we are going to give red color so that is the convention that is normally followed so let us go to shape fill and add green color to this and let us remove the outline let us add some gradient to this one so go to shape fill go to gradient and choose this option called as linear right as you can see here it goes from darker green color to lighter green color which is the way we want it now that we have got pros in place let us go to the cons so we are going to create a duplicate by pressing ctrl d which is the shortcut for duplicate and i am going to flip this horizontally so let us go to arrange rotate and flip horizontal and this is going to be here what i have done here is the end of the stem of the arrows aligns with the arrow head for the second one and let us uh, give this red color as we have discussed earlier and we will also give a gradient this time linear left okay so this is actually it should be going from here to right so we need to stick to linear right because we have just flipped this particular diagram this shape so this is good this we are going to call as cons beautiful now we need to connect these two things together. So for this, I'm going to use this freeform tool under lines. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to click on one of the corners, the top right corners of cons, and I'm going to click on the top left corner of pros. Then I'm going to go down and click in the bottom left corner. And I'm going to click here. I'm going to click here and I'm going to Send to back and I'm going to give it a dark gray color, remove the outline and if you need, maybe you can even add gradient of linear right and that's it. So we have cons and pros neatly connected. Now let us write our text here and it's very simple. First you write your title, your subtitle text. So this is going to be the subtitle for our pros let us increase the size to 24 make it bold and keep it here let us uh, add some points here so i'm going to add bullet points you can replace this sample text so that is what is going to be the dummy text we're going to use let me uh, copy by using ctrl c and i'm going to copy a couple of times so that looks good. I can increase the font from 18 to 20 and I can place this right under this one. If need be, I can choose a separator by choosing this line and drawing a straight line that separates the title from the associated text. Let us give this black color. Maybe we can increase the weight to say one and a half points and I'm going to select all these elements and press Control G to group them. I'm going to make a copy of this by holding the control button and moving it to a new position to explain the cons. And that is it. Our pros and cons diagram is ready. It's a very simple and practical slide to create for your business presentations. I want to show you some fancier and nicer alternatives to the simple diagram taken from our CEO packs. This is the first one where you can see the pros and cons even um, reinforced with these beautiful uh, icons and you have factors that don't support and factors that support and let us say audience or customer poll result and you have these two buttons one 
saying no and another one saying yes and uh, another alternative is this one which shows two sides of the argument for and against these are all simple 100% editable templates you just have to go there replace the sample text with your own text the angle and everything is already taken care of this is another example which shows weighing the pros and cons you have pros written down on one side and cons written down on another side simple visual representation of the idea and the last one is this one which shows for and against points here if you are a busy business presenter who doesn't have the time to create such diagrams for yourself you can always take a look at our off the shelf solutions like our powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 the two ceo packs have more than 1600 fully editable charts and graphics for ceos and busy business presenters like you just choose the template that matches your thought replace the sample text with your own text and your business slides get ready in no time creating professional quality business slides has never been easier Hope you liked our tutorial on creating simple pros and cons diagram in PowerPoint. If you want to learn more such tutorials or you want to improve your presentation skills or PowerPoint skills, you can always visit us at presentationprocess.com. Thanks a lot for watching the video. Happy presenting.